Hey everyone, welcome back to more Let's Play Dark Souls, and here we go. This guy wasn't hard to begin with, but now that we have a lightning weapon, he's going to be, yeah, see, he does <laughs> a great sword, or great shield there, it does not, uh, it does not parry. It has a striking attack. Ow! Ow! <laughs> I wish you could get that mace. I don't think anything... I don't think there's any way to get that, but... Drop anything? Nah, asshole. Alright, let's, let's press on. But one thing about heavy armor, though, is it... It's, uh, it gives you an inherent uh, stamina penalty as far as regen so something to keep in mind okay as we head up this way um, there here's we're about to fight a unique enemy this dude right here this knight uh, and he is rocking the elite knight armor he's got a parrying shield or a target shield or whatever or buckler whatever he's got one of those one of those whatever shields like the Balder Knights guys. Uh, and he has Rickard's Rapier. Um, let me go over here. Now, for Rapier stuff, this thing is amazing. Um, it uh, requires 20, uh, 20 dexterity, so it takes a little more than, than a regular one. Um, blah, 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 doesn't matter. It's about Rickard. That was undead. Prince Rickard that we just killed him. Um, for PVE, it's amazing. It's R2. You can like chain them right together, and you can get in like like ten hits or something, like within a two seconds. Crazy good. Um, you can enchant it. You can't make it lightning or anything like that, but you can enchant it with um, uh, some of the. Well, like Crystal Magic Weapon or, or stuff like that that's in the sorcery side or some of the faith-based stuff. So that's that's kind of cool. Um, not as good for PvP because its, it's moveset's kind of lacking other than that R2, but I've used it, and that thing will eat enemies up. Whether you have it enchanted or not, but it will it'll do work. Alright, so let's press on. Uh, that's pretty much everything I want to show you. Um, should I... Should I... Nah, let's heal up, just in case. You guys know the way... The way this stuff goes with me. Uh, doop. Okay. In fact... Do we have any... Where's my... Okay. I could bring that up to 10. Could be bringing that up. Yeah, let's go ahead and let's level this thing up to plus 5. And the next time we see what's his name, we'll have him ascend it for us. Alright, there's that. We can reinforce our armor. Let's see, what is the... Okay, yeah, it requires Twinkling Titanite as well. That's fine. Not a problem. Reinforce weapon. We are going to reinforce the Lightning Spear a little bit. Um, well, that dog's being stupid. Uh, we'll go to... Yeah, we'll go ahead and take it to plus three. That'll put us... Yeah, we're doing 400 damage basically with it. 196 and 196. By and large, though, you don't want to split your damage. Um, at least not its base damage. Uh, any damage you add from like a buff or something is, is one thing, but when you put on lightning or fire or anything like that, it removes all scaling from the weapons. Um, which makes this particular weapon, I mean, look at its requirements. 11 strength and 10 dexterity. So basically, almost any character can wield it. 
Um, any character can two-hand it. Um, uh, I, I think maybe the only thing that might start with less than ten decks is uh, maybe a sorcerer. Um, but for one or two stat points, um, it's worth it uh, so if you don't want to use another weapon. Cage key, so in order to get the that just unlocks that. In order to get the um, shortcut to work, you need to step into it. Uh, and this puts you right back at the very beginning. Run out, run back in so that it will trigger it back up. And yeah, that guy will shoot you with lightning if, if you're not careful. So Now that weight brings the other one down so that now if you come back from the other direction, you'll have a shortcut. So. And my dog's getting loud. I'm about to have to kick her in the face. I would not do that. Not to my, not to my Lola. I'm going to yell at her, though. Uh, but what we're going to do is I'm going to get us up to the point where we're going to summon Iron Tarkus. And next episode, we will fight... Well, no, I might have time. i got six minutes. Yeah, that's more than enough. But she's being annoying. I don't know. Yeah, no, she's being too annoying. Okay. Alright, so you come over here, human form, Iron Tarkus. When we come back, we'll have me some Iron Tarkus. It's gonna be awesome.